Hi guys, in today's video, we'll be going through exercise 5.18 digit sum. So first of all, let's read the problem. Write a method named digit sum that accepts an integer as a parameter and returns the sum of the digits of that number. For example, digit sum 29107 returns 2 plus 9 plus 1 plus 0 plus 7 or 19. For negative numbers, return the same value that would result if the number were positive. For example, digit sum negative 456 returns 4 plus 5 plus 6 or 15. So I think the problem we are going to solve is, that, is to find the sum of all digits. And the main point is that negative numbers return the same value as positive numbers. So I'm going to say n equals math dot apps, which means absolute value, n. And then I'm just going to make another int called sum equals 0. So I'm just going to use this as my final answer and return it for later use. And I'm just going to write while n is not equal to 0, um, we should find the remainder. So we're going to say sum plus equals n modulus 10 in order to find the remainder. So this is the equation to find the remainder. And then in order to go, go to the next digit, we're going to use n slash equals 10. And then we're going to close it. And then we're going to write return sum. Let's run it. Yay. Hey.